Hey there, Samantha Garrett here, and today I wanna to show you how you can use Google Keep and Google Docs together. So these tools are the best of friends, and I've got three little tips that you can use to make the most of this friendship. So let's jump in now and take a look. Okay, so here I am in a Google Doc, and what we're gonna start by doing is opening Google Keep from the side panel in Google Docs. So on the right hand side here, you should see this little panel and you'll see I've got a little Google Keep note up the top. Now, if some, for some reason you don't see this panel, you don't see this little icon, then it probably means you've collapsed it. So right down the bottom, there's this little arrow. You can see if I hover over it, it says hide side panel. So if I click that, it'll be hidden and then I've got a little arrow, I can pop it back out. So once you've got it there, if I click on the little Google Keep icon, it's going to open up my Google Keep notes. So you'll see I've got a few here. Now, what I can do from this, um, from this little pane is two really clever things. One, I can put the contents of the, of the note straight in the document. So I can just click on these little dots here and I can say add to document and it's gonna pop it straight over like that. So wherever my cursor is, it's gonna insert that content. Now, the other thing I can do is I can come over here where it says take a note and if I click on that, I can start taking a note so I can pop on a title and my, my notes here. But what's really cool is it's actually included a link to the document in my note. So you can see it here, and that's the name of the document, Google Docs plus Google Keep. So I'm gonna go ahead and put a title in. I'm gonna call this test note, and we'll just pop a little bit of text here, good old blah, blah. So that's saved now. So what we'll do is we'll jump on over to Google Keep and you'll see in just a sec, there it is. There's that note including the link to the document which I can click on to go straight back to it. So this is really good if you are perhaps reviewing a document and you just wanna take some notes to yourself, um, you know, to be able to use later on, this is a really good way to do it because you can do it in the side panel, then open it up in Keep and you've got the link. Okay, now third tip is actually from this Google Keep interface. So. Any note that's in here, so we'll open this one up here, we can convert to a Google Doc. So again, down the bottom here, these little dots, you'll click on them and you'll see we've got the copy to Google Docs option. So what this will do is create a brand new Google Doc with the same title as the note and it will copy all the contents from the note into that document. So I really love this when I've been using a note to, for example, take agenda items, which is exactly what this note is, or maybe just as a starting point for capturing ideas for a proposal I've got to write or anything I've got to put together. I start in Keep and then I copy it over Google Docs to continue. So there we have it, three of my top tips for using Google Docs and Google Keep together. I'd love to hear if any of these are useful for you. Feel free to drop a comment below if they are, or just give us a like if that is easier. So if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, be sure to do so as well, so you can be notified when all the latest videos on Google tips and tricks are available. So that's it for now. See you next time.